catching up, bud. Sorry, I just saw some ducks crossing the pond. <laughs> I need a new chew. So, router boy, what brings a pack of muscle like you into the army? I borrowed some money from my sister. She gets knocked out with twins. She asked for the money back, so. So you need money? Yes, sir. Well, then let's get you a full-time position. I can pull a few strings. Romania, sound good? Get a fucking gymnast on your cock for 100K? <laughs> Don't try recruiting me, though, because I want to live. Hey, Reddick. You can't piss, shit, talk, fucking walk a dog unless I fucking tell you you can, okay? Why is he sharing his life story? Because I gave him permission to speak freely, not you. I didn't know speaking freely was a thing. You just gotta tell me these things and I'll abide by the rules. See this? See this? This is why we gotta get you out to Romania or fucking fuck off to Sweden, get some blondes on that cock. You don't have to deal with the fucking greenhorns. What are the odds of dying in war now anyways, right? Slim to none. It's probably fun to kill somebody. Best feeling of your life. It wouldn't be fun to kill anyone. You moron. For 100K? I do it. Yes, sir. No, sir. 100K. Absolutely. That towel head? Boom. That towel head? Boom. That's a little kid. Boom. I don't care. What are you talking about? There's no way that would be fun. You'd be terrible and you'd carry that guilt your whole life. Guilt? What the fuck's guilt? It's the feeling that... Never heard of it. You sound like they would beat me up at the bar the other day. And I did nothing. I, was, I didn't say anything. All I whoa, said was, whoa, hey, whoa. move it, buddy. Too and he personal. knocks me the fuck out. That's okay by he's, your logic. He's a hero. <laughs> He's a hero. Fuck, you want your own radio show, don't you? Talking up a storm all the time. AM 640, we got Greenhorn Reddick on the line. Yeah, excuse me, my bicycle's... Shut the fuck up, next caller. That's a soldier. You're the next James Bond, I swear. I can tell. You know what? We should put you in a medium. I think this is a large. Come on, inside the tent. Maps, compasses ready. War simulation's begun. All right, so the Colombians have invaded Halliburton. Now, under combat conditions, it's essential that we know our location and we understand the geography. You know what? We're only eight kilometers away from my cottage, sir. We go north past the swamp, take the Bob Cajun Bridge, we're there. Gorgeous A-frame with sunsets overlooking the lake. Four bedrooms, nice big eat-in kitchen, stone fireplace. I made a pizza on it once. Ace navigating, router boy. No, that's Ace instructing, sir. Oh, God. <laughs> now, the closer these contour lines are together, well, that's an indicator of... Uh, Elevation. Uh, and the further apart uh, is depression. Hey, I was diagnosed with depression. Nobody cares. What? Uh, could you actually please put your notepad away? I feel like you're fucking wiki leaks and you're recording everything I say so you can fucking... Bust me. No, I'm just, I'm into maps. Hold on, man. hold on, hold on. Shit can your mouth. No, I just like maps. Whoa, whoa, shit can your fucking mouth. Mayday, mayday. We are escalating to a high state of readiness. Get to your battle stations, everyone. Don't get that gun out of my face. I will never tell you the truth. I will never tell you where they're hiding it. No, Dick, let go of me. Get as I need you. They're killing everybody. Ah! <laughs> This is Officer Guinness. Hello? General Radulescu here reporting, maybe for the last time. It saddened me to say, Halifax has been taken. Halifax has been taken, I repeat, this is not a simulation. I repeat, this is not a simulation. Holy fucking doomsday. Guinness, you stay alive. We're sending a chopper to your coordinates. Ch ch chopper We all need you to man up, Guinness. Okay, pals. Yeah, uh, looking forward to fighting beside all yes. You heard him, boys. We're going to the show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, sure. I need another chew. Classic war simulation. <laughs> what? <laughs> Just trying to convince us it's real. Yeah, Guinness wouldn't lie to us. He's an honest guy. Uh, and it's a bullshit simulation, too, because we're reserves and Canada can't force us to fight. No, I mean, if we were invaded, they could tap into the reserves. 
Canada hasn't been invaded. No, but if we have, they could make us fight. But we haven't been. No, but if we have been, they could. And I gotta fight. Fight what? I'm like, I gotta get that money. See it yourself. I didn't sign up to the army to be part of a war. What are you guys doing? So Canada's been invaded. By who? Who was it? Who did it this time? Was it the Chinese? Malaysia? I think it was the Malaysians that invaded us. Yeah, yeah. They hate us. Rennick. Hands a tenant too, bud. We're going to the show. <laughs> God. You guys. What are you guys in on this together? Holy Mother art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. This is Officer Guinness here again. You know me. We fucking talk every day. Give us the strength to fucking win this goddamn war, eh? Sorry about that whole shit, eh? When you got fucking crucified, sorry about that. I don't get this joke. And I get dry, irony, slapstick, broad, big, small, everything. I'm not feeding into this joke. Reddick? I suggest you pray to that eight-legged elephant, whoever the fuck you believe in. May God have mercy on our souls. Ridiculous. I'll take the high road if you take the low road. And we'll be in Winnipeg in the morning. Even if this war was real, you couldn't make me fight. Give a non-violent man a gun, and he'll shoot you in the face with kindness. Calm down, calm down, bud. It's just fucking war. It's been happening since the fucking dawn of man. It's a natural state, okay? You think you're the first fucking guy to go to war? Huh, bud? Your fucking dad and your pops is pops. This was supposed to be a weekend gig. I should have borrowed money from my parents. There's no shame in that. There's no shame. I think I'm gonna go to school in the fall for graphic design. doing here? I'm out for a night walk. Why do you have all your stuff? Look, I'm going to my cottage, okay? Look, I can't sleep in that tent. It's freezing. I'm just going for the night, then I'll be back by dawn. It's fine. Go back. Whoa, 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 whoa. You wouldn't be trying to desert the army now, would you? <laughs> Holy shit, the rats are fleeing the city. <laughs> I'm not a rat. Just beyond those trees, Canada's burning. I want to fight. I want to fight. But I just put a down payment on the house and I can't afford to lose it. With the lawyer bills and four years of back taxes, I'm still trying to pursue acting. I'm just busy. I am just too busy. Let me come with you. No. This is a solo mission. You find your own place to hide. You're gonna be eaten by a wolf. Free, skinny boy. 
not resisting. This is Officer Guinness. I got two deserters, one in my custody, other one fucked right off into the swamp. Please advise. You're going down. What, treason? High treason? Yeah. See what my dad says about that. Your country needs you. I'm not going to war. Well, you're going to a military jail then. Is that what you want? Military jail? I've been to one of those things on my field trips. Those things have water slides, pools. Yeah, send me to that. And my dad's a doctor, by the way, who's got lawyer friends, and those lawyers can get me out of anything. I'm real afraid of your fucking pops. Dude, I'm from Oakville, Ontario, man. You can't fuck with me. OK, so. your status? Yes, hello. Officer Guinness here. I got two deserters. One's rat face fuck in front of me. The other one fucked right off in a Bob Cajun swamp. Over. Call your men off. I said, call your men off. You're going down there, hotshot. That's an order, soldier. I'm not going anywhere. Do you know who I am? My dad owns the Toronto Raptors. I don't give a fuck who your dad is. My dad owns the ballet. Oh, you fucking better watch it. I come from art money, man. Group of seven, ever heard Jesus of it? Jesus fucking Christ. Tom Thompson, that's my great uncle. Officer Guinness, where did that fucking chopper? When I'm through with you, you'll be fucking shoveling shit at Harvey's. Get me that fucking chopper. We've run out of choppers. How about we send you a tank? Tank sounds marvelous. <laughs> oh my god! Okay, guys, shut up, shut up. Guinness, Guinness. Canada hasn't been invaded, man. It's a joke. Uh, no wonder you're stuck in the middle of nowhere teaching those weekend warriors. <laughs> Obviously it hasn't been fucking invaded! Who the fuck told you? I'm fucking... I know! I'm in on the joke, you idiots! It was my fucking idea to do that joke! Okay, pal. Fuck you! Fuck you! It's my goddamn joke, you don't take credit for it! <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> <laughs> you think that's fucking funny, don't you? Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Anybody who'd play a joke like that on someone's a fucking sick fuck, aren't they? Yes. Funny joke, sir. <laughs> Rattleboy really not coming back? No. You think because I'm in charge I don't got any fucking feelings? Why have you done this to me, Jesus? Just... Guinness, it's okay. it's okay. I'm still here. If you want to go join your buddy in the fucking swamp, get the fuck out of here. Well, since there's no war, I'd kind of like to stay. had a decency to make his bed before he fucked me in the ass. What are you doing? You've always been pretty good at that. You taught me this, sir. Suppose I did, didn't I? What else you get at? Permission to speak freely? Yeah, all right. Well, uh, Muay Thai boxing, I take a DJ class, and... DJ? I had a free Saturday, so I thought I'd... Join the army and work on my physique. So it's just a part-time thing for you. It's kind of a part-time thing, yeah. We're nowhere near my cottage. You're in a shit can. <laughs>